get you in here. All right. So this is the professor. I am at the Bell Time Club Wrestling School. Today was the Perry Saturn seminar. And Perry, after a long day of teaching, everybody has uh, agreed to end the day with a couple of minutes talking to us. So thank you very much, Mr. Saturn. Um, let me ask you a couple questions uh, about your relationship with Paul Richard. What's who, who? going on? Paul Richard, the extreme or oh, just yeah, okay, the enforcer. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Tell us about your relationship with Paul. He was a referee. How about your No, he's my friend. I'm just <laughs> ripping him. Yeah, we were friends, you know. He, we, he helped me out a lot when I was young and stuff, you know. So he's a good guy. And how long have you guys known each other? Too long. Decades? Yeah, oh, for sure. Where, for where, sure. Where did you first meet up with Paul? Uh, through Walter, through Kowalski. So it was way before the ECW days? Oh, yeah, yeah, way before. Before I even had wrestling boots, probably. Going all the way back to yeah, the Kowalski yeah, School. Yeah. Uh, excellent. So uh, now, as Paul has announced uh, publicly last night at the Hall of Fame ceremony, and, and he and I have been working on a project for a long time uh, about his CTE condition, um, we know that you're also uh, experiencing some of the same things. Could you talk a little bit about your experience with CTE? And I know, uh, you know, Paul has been a part of your life and you guys have shared some things. Could you maybe talk a little bit about CTE for us? There, it, there's really nothing to say. Here's the deal. Uh, sometimes in my house, I black out, I do shit, I don't remember what I'm doing, I hide like, things like my remotes and stuff, it makes no sense. When I go to bed at night, I know maybe this is the last night, I'm, tomorrow when I wake up, I'm not gonna be me, so there's nothing to say, it's just the shits, you know, and uh, that's it, there's, you know, doing stupid things, like you sit there and my wife will say, uh, like I stand in my kid's room, and it's pitch dark, and I'm just standing in there, I don't remember doing that. No, I don't know why I was doing it, but who knows? You know, the big deal that I'm trying, that it's not as bad as I hide shit when I black out, and then it takes me forever to find it, and I have no idea why I do it. So, and that sucks when you lose your mind and you just don't know what's going on. It, you know, I'd rather have it just go all at once, so that, because once I lose it, then it won't matter, I won't know anything, but as you're creeping into it, it's the shits. So... And if that doesn't answer your question tough, that's the best I can do. <laughs> okay, that answers the question. <laughs> Perry Saturn, thank you very much. We appreciate it. All right, man. Thank you. Oh.